everybody. I thought I would give you a quick update um, about uh, a few things that happened at today's commission meeting. Uh, the first is actually big and broad. It was the establishment of a Biscayne Bay Task Force that will really begin um, looking into what sort of actions we need to be taking from a holistic perspective to make sure that um, our water in our bay thrives for years and maybe centuries even to come. Uh, so that is very exciting. So looking forward to um, watching that task force kick off soon. And the second thing is a little more local for District 5, but for people who live in downtown, they know that access to park spaces uh, we, we don't have very many, and so we have to be creative from time to time. Um, but the county just exercised an interlocal agreement, which is just an agreement with the city of Miami, so that an area under the Metro Mover can be activated as a green space between Northeast 2nd Street and Northeast 3rd Street, so really close to Miami-Dade College. Uh, so looking forward to having that space, which is now kind of dead and dark and truthfully a little creepy, um, be activated in a more um, positive and neighborhood friendly way. Um, anyway, I'm heading home after uh, stopping off at the West Avenue Neighborhood Association here in Miami Beach where we talked about a lot of things but uh, pedestrian crosswalks and pedestrian safety high on the list um, as it is in almost every neighborhood that I go to. Anyway, have a great evening and we will talk to you after the next commission meeting.